In this example, I need to simplify the square root of 96. 96 is not a perfect square, so I'm going to use the product rule of radicals that states for any non-negative real numbers a and b and any index n, the nth root of a times b equals the nth root of a times the nth root of b. Now in this case, we have a radical that doesn't have an index. But remember, that means with square roots, there's an implied index of 2 here. So we know n equals 2 and the square root of a times b equals the square root of a times the square root of b. We're going to use this rule once I've factored my 96 into factors that are perfect squares and non-perfect squares. Now there are many different ways to factor 96. The first method I'm going to show you is prime factorization. It's an even number, it's divisible by 2, 2 divides into 96 48 times. 48 is even, 2 goes into 48 24 times. Still even, 2 goes into 24 12, keep going, 12 is even, 2 divides into 12 6 times, and 2 divides into 6 3 times. So here are my prime factors of 96. Now I'm going to group them to make either perfect squares or non-perfect squares. I'm going to group these two twos together and these two twos together. And then finally my leftovers are 2 times 3. So I know that the square root of 96 is going to equal the square root of 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 times 3 is 6. Now using this rule, I can write that as the square root of 4 times the square root of 4 times the square root of 6. The square root of 4 is 2. The square root of this 4 is 2. So I have 2 times 2. The square root of 6 does not simplify, so it's just the square root of 6. So my answer is 2 times 2 is 4 times the square root of 6. Another way to factor 96 is to realize it's divisible by 3. 3 divides into 96 32 times. 32 is even, it divides by 2. 2 divides into 32 16 times. But I'm not going to continue factoring. 16 is a perfect square. So I'm going to write 96 as 16 times 6. So the square root of 96 is the square root of 16 times 6, which using this rule is the square root of 16 times the square root of 6. What's the square root of 16? 4. The square root of 6 does not simplify. So my answer is 4 times the square root of 6. Notice I got exactly the same answer even though I factored the 96 by a different method. So as long as your factoring method is correct, it means you will get this correct answer.